moment of truth. Hi everyone, welcome to Bookie's Kitchen Takeover and my friends and I have taken over the Woodscope Kitchen today to do something fun and creative. We're going to be picking mystery and random ingredients from labeled jars and we're going to try to come up with something interesting, creative and something that's edible as well. <laughs> Keyword being edible. So we don't know what's in the jars, we're just going to pick one from a jar labeled cards one from a jar labelled protein and two from a jar labelled others. And then we get 30 minutes to come up with something to cook and then we're doing the actual cooking. We also have a back pantry which has supporting ingredients, things like seasonings, oils and that type of thing to support what we pick from the main jars. So yes, this is supposed to be fun and interesting and we can't wait to see how it goes. So yeah. This is Tito and this is Buki and what we are doing today is I'm going to be picking random ingredients and I have just 30 minutes to cook anything I pick here. Interesting right? I cannot wait to see what I'm going to pick and I cannot wait for you guys to see what I'm going to cook. You can pick one from each mm -hmm. of protein and cards and you pick two from others. Interesting. Shall we? Let's. We shall. <laughs> Let me help you pick protein. <laughs> Okay, dun 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 Miss Miss Ooh That's not bad Okay let's see I'm picking one from here Okay Noodles Ah come on So now you're gonna pick two from here Okay Abracadabra Okay, I have raw pepper mix. Ah, so why? Is that you guys. Corn on the corn. Corn on the corn. Why? How? Wow, okay. Later. This is like the easiest thing ever. I feel like this should have been for Tito. It's too long. Two more. Ten minutes. Are you guys ready for me? have just 30 minutes to cook anything I pick here. So, I'm gonna make a noodle Tito, soup. why are you always running? I don't understand though. <laughs> um, I'll make a noodle soup and while that is working, I'll start to boil my corn because um, I just boil the corn for like 10 minutes. Okay. okay. Five to 10 minutes. Let everything, we'll just mix everything together, together. just to mix. mix Let me know if you want me to. Any special plans for the corn? Uh, well, you see that the end. <laughs> Any special plans for the minced meat is what I want to know. For the minced yeah. meat, you'll see it now. I feel like you got it easy, Tolani. Like, Same, you know, what I kind of mix is this? <laughs> As this is like really, so unfair. She's over, you know, qualified for, you know? for a new dish. I'm just going <laughs> to add a little salt to the corn okay. so that that starts to cook. And I'll proceed to just prepare my minced meat sauce immediately. Okay. Okay. Yeah, so what do you so need? Oil? Oil for... I was saying, what do you ladies typically prefer having with noodles? Ah, egg. Oh, really? I like noodles and egg, okay. like a lot. Okay. What do you um, want? I personally, yeah, yeah the, the spring onions. I personally like to cook instead of onions. I, I personally like to use spring onions. I don't know why, even though yes, onions was born from spring onions, right? Mm -hmm. So I'm going to. So they say. <laughs> that is good. Tito, your beard. <laughs> Look at that! I knew what I was doing. <laughs> Your lashes. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yeah, so that's working. Um, I have the, the sweet corn cookie. No worries, it's not going to splash over. Mm -hmm. What do you want now? Yeah. Um, the I'll meat. need the minced meat now. Yeah. I just need to try having the plantain. 
Okay, please, can I have some more oil? I don't know. That noodles and plantain business, it, I can't. No, I, it doesn't I feel, go I feel noodles for me. So why add plantain again? Like, that's my own issue is I like my plantain on its own. I shade you. I like my plantain on its own. Really? Yeah. Um, so maybe plantain and eggs or plantain and beans. Yeah. I don't eat plantain and rice. Any tea. kind of rice, jollof rice, fried rice. I don't eat plantain and rice. Members, they don't. They ah. do actually. White rice? Plantain no, plantain and, and rice. rice. Oh, oh ah. Like plantain and white rice with correct stew. That's yeah, my favorite, man. I mean, I know that people eat that, but. Not, not your my love for plantain, I want Just it on its own, yeah. and then I can eat it with beans. Absolutely. Okay, right. yeah, yeah, plantain and beans is actually also really good. Yeah. But good rice and plantain, I like my rice and stew on its own. Mm. Okay. My plantain on its own, and if you dish it, if I come over to yours and you dish it for me, I'm going to eat my plantain and eat my rice. So I eat my rice first. I, eat, I won't mix them. There's never too much garlic, guys. Add that garlic. I love garlic. Add that garlic. I love garlic. Garlic so is flavor. I just went in with the garlic powder. I'm going to add yeah, some. Yeah. 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 Spring so, onions. Spring onions. I'm going to add some onion powder. There's just no way that this is not going to be good. Yeah. We should have thrown in yogurt or something. Eto! <laughs> Duh! <laughs> you marinate the mincemeat with yogurt, I guess. Okay. I need some um, chicken seasoning. Yeah. It's loaded. Yeah, bad like that. Uh -huh. Think, 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 no think, think. Mm -hmm. You don't like to shout. I know, I know. We can see. No. <laughs> we can see. We should not do, don't hype too much. I mean, give me pepper mix. <laughs> okay. It smells good, you guys. It does smell good. By the way, this is the kitchen meal says pepper mix show. It's called the kitchen meals raw pepper mix. Mm. Also available the smooth pepper mix too. Uh -huh. Come on. <laughs> Come on. I'm it in the <laughs> check it in the milk. <laughs> okay. How long have you had your pepper mix? Um, since March of last year. Last year. Going it's been going good. A lot of, you know, big stores. Well, no, so I'm still selling it um, from directly from, directly from me, yes. So, so to so order. Do, okay, yeah, um, sorry, booking. Okay. To order, just find me. On and you'll. Online, on Instagram. Okay. And I'll have it delivered freshly made to you. Tito, do you like to taste your food while cooking? Do you like to taste it? I kind of feel like it doesn't have a choice. <laughs> He said only plantain. Oh, like eating it, you're not tasting it. Yeah, what yeah, what that's is not plantain tasting. to taste, you guys? <laughs> How about you, Buki? Do you like to taste your food while that's cooking? I don't know if I like to. I just find that I don't even taste. I don't. I don't taste. I just cook here and then it is what it Whatever is. Whatever comes out. <laughs> Whatever <laughs> comes out. It is what it is. How about you, uh, well, once in a while, not every time. You kind because of I find know what you're doing, yeah. so. Mm -hmm. Especially since done it so many times, I don't know how it's going to turn out. Exactly. But sometimes maybe you taste for salt or something. Okay. I have my minced meat ready. So you turn up the Is eat. that all for that? Yeah. Ooh. Like I said, the end result is the cocoa. Mm. <laughs> Anything you see. No, but I feel like <laughs> this, can't, this can't go wrong. I don't think this can go wrong. Let's see how Tanani did the time. Wow, she has eight minutes. She's done eight minutes. She's done eight minutes. <laughs> Uh, and the food is almost ready. Not bad. So I'm making a noodle soup now, and I'm gonna put my sweet corn inside the noodle soup. Okay. Also, then at the end, I'll um, sprinkle some minced meat over it and some, you know, black pepper. Mado. <laughs> so, <laughs> we do you have a name? We'll give the name later, please. <laughs> wow, some corn and okay. mm -hmm. So. Yeah. So because it's a noodle soup, um, the the water is gonna be more than. Two. Okay. Um, do you like to break your noodles? I like, let, me, let me just ask you. I don't, I don't, I don't mind. Thank you. But I typically don't. I'll break it just for... Yeah, for it to fit. Yeah. 
Yeah, I need some fresh pepper mixture. You know, it is noodles, you want spicy mm -hmm. and all that, yeah, so. Yeah, so I'm just going to add a little, and just for beauty. Okay. For color. For color. <laughs> for color. <laughs> Wanna wow, chefs, did they try you? Okay. Are you a trained chef? Self-trained. <laughs> Thanks. Self-trained. <laughs> we always add our own razzle-dazzle. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Um, yeah, I'll need? need the garlic and onion powder now. This is garlic. And this is onion. Yeah. Challenge I always had with uh, learning how to cook. I might you have know, to taste this buy one. Myself or online or something, it's the measurements. It's, um, I always worry that I won't get the measurements of this, that, and the other. So, you something. know, I say that cooking is to your taste. So, you can get kind of like. Um, the framework mm -hmm. from someone yeah. but then you still have to cook it to your taste unless you know very specific dishes that have to taste a certain way mm -hmm. otherwise things like noodles things mm -hmm. like mincemeat sauce you cook it to your own taste mm -hmm. do you want it spicy do you want it sweet you know just you know even when you're learning even when you're just starting to learn new things um trial and error trial and error so you kind of figure out what you like right and that is how you figure out what you like you cook it this way today and even you, you can tell that man not tried. <laughs> yeah, it happens. It know, happens to many of us it too. Happens to mm -hmm. it, happens it happens to everyone. It happens to everyone. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. It happens to everyone. But as you cook it, then you know, okay, I like this. I don't like this. Or I mm -hmm. should cook it like this. Or mm -hmm. I shouldn't cook it like this. Kind of thing. Yeah. Um, it'll be nice for the noodles to get soggy. Okay. So. Go chef. Thanks, thanks, thanks. The sweet corn has cooked a little, so I'll just add it to the soup so it can continue to cook and the spice can also go into and the soup. And I was going to yeah. say, ooh, I like sweet corn. I love sweet corn. This dish is from work alone. Ah. Shai from Tolani's kitchen. From Tolani. Is the Tolani original? Yes, I need chopsticks, please. <laughs> oh my. Chopsticks, please. <laughs> oh my god. That looks good. Thank you. A little bit spicy. Yeah, I think so. I might just need to add some more black pepper. Okay. Or, yeah. It looks good. I told so you. So Tito doesn't find his. His mouth too much. <laughs> it does have an oriental look, not a bad Do you know? It looks really, really inviting. So, you know. She's winging it to us. He's on vibes. This is all on vibes. It's fireball. You just mix everything together. No, but it looks like, it, I mean, it, it looks like something that tastes good. Yeah, yeah. Mm. And I already know. Thanks, guys. Thanks, thanks. Do you like noodles, Tito? I do. You know, as a bachelor. Yeah, of course. Yeah, does he thing. have an option? You know. Do you have an option? Top five of every bachelor. How do you cook your noodles? noodles. <laughs> I'm just normal way. I do like three, put it in water, maybe corned beef, um, plantain standard, beef <laughs> <laughs> or chicken. But I don't put that much into it when I'm cooking. So it's just, I just put extra pepper, some thyme, some curry, and yeah. For a bachelor, you know some things. Yeah. For me, no, really? Yeah. yeah. I'm surprised. I know bachelors that man, can cook me. You, I'm talking about you specifically. I, I feel like I don't know that much, to be honest. Like, like, yeah, doing okay. Like some I people will buy so food. <laughs> at least you know how to turn on your cooker. <laughs> That's the <a> start. <laughs> and you actually have a kitchen and you have things in your kitchen. Yeah. Some people just buy food. They have bowls and bowls and bowls yeah, of things. And empty bowl because all their okay. cabinets in the oh, kitchen. They just buy. Them. They just buy. Like, uh -huh. Some like, just go to Amala Joint exactly. today. They go to, you know. I went to the market. Uh, it's actually a You task. go to the market. So, Seeing a guy cook is something that I, I really like appreciate it. because cooking, even for we ladies, is a task. Yeah. It's tasking. It's nice and pleasant as well. Mm -hmm. You were saying you went to the market? Yeah, I went to the market and I don't know, just planting tomatoes, yam, and all that. I bought yam. Yam that I used to buy for like 700, 800. 
<laughs> that must have been years ago. Well, because even yam is more expensive now. Everything is more expensive now. Back in the day, that would have been like a really huge tube of yam. Yeah, you know. Now, this is the average one, one five. I was shocked. I was saying, I was complaining online the other day. Two five. For a tuba of yam, regular size tuba of yam, not like a big tuba of yam. That's what I used to go to um, those, those like markets yam. that they call village market. You and you buy a set yam. of yam for 3,000 mm -hmm. and it set to six. Let me turn up the heat and um, serve this now. Or so maybe I just want to eat. <laughs> Is why I'm saying that. They enter my eye. <laughs> Do you remember when noodles came on the market? Yeah, in the 90s or something. In the 90s, yeah. yes. I think I've told my noodle story now. Mm -hmm. That I cooked a whole carton of noodles. Yeah. This particular noodle brand, they came to my school mm -hmm. and you know, there was a dancing competition and I won a pack of noodles, wow. you know. I was meant to go home and, you know, show it to my mom instead. I cooked it all. In school there. I cooked it all. Why? Did they beg you? No, I cooked it all at home for at my home. siblings and I. Oh. So yes. your mom never saw it? She saw it, she saw the remnants <laughs> and the pack, so you know. Sad. When she got home, I was so happy. I was like, mommy, ah, they came to our school. They gave us a box of noodles and everything. And she was like, where's the noodles? And I'm like, ah, this is, <laughs> this is your own. This is your own. I chop bits in. How many siblings did you have? How many siblings have four. All four, packs of us, noodles. all four of us <laughs> ate almost everything. Then we left some for my parents. Oh, okay. So I was so happy thinking my mommy was going to come She'll home. She'll be proud of you. And be proud of me. <laughs> I said, ah, your girl, you cooked. Ah, noodles. Oh, yeah, now. Make me chop. One more. The beat. I didn't go to school for three days. <laughs> Why? Because I was, I was fetching. We, the, I was fetching water. <laughs> Meanwhile, we had water, tap water run. Oh. Ah, no, my mom. Ah, oh, as punishment. Friends. What's punishment now? Something that she want. Wow. Yeah, but you're supposed no. to show. Before, right? I'm supposed okay, back in I cooked the a whole carton of noodles. Even and then exactly about it now is actually unbelievable. Like, yo, <laughs> Tola, did you actually really do that? That's forty packs of noodles. I was actually, uh, I was. Uh, well, hey, my mom, my mom was. Uh, yeah. I know. Right mom. now, you can tell. You link up with your siblings. You'll be like, you remember do you remember that? Time? that? <laughs> <laughs> and wow. I also add that then I chop beating. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, actually, they will add that part, and then you chop beating. Do you want me to help you do that? Okay, let me, let me okay, yeah. While you're doing the last one. Thank you. See the presentation says, can you scoop some of your presentations? Everyone here with us in the studio, you see their mouths are watching and inside. Behind the cameras, they're like, oh my God. This one will not remain, no. I promise you. Saying that my ingredients were easy and everything, I'm like, you know, you don't have anything easy. I made noodle soup with sweet corn and uh, minced meat, and it was really, really good, you guys. It came out really nice. Like, it was so tasty. I garnished it with um, black pepper and all that, and they gave me really, really good scores. Tolani's pot caught fire. Actually, somebody got a picture of me with my mouth really open. Like, I thought the whole set was on fire. <laughs> But well, she handled it well, like the pro that she is, and she flipped her thing in it, and you know, she was calm. I'm like, go girl. <laughs> that was too funny, because I was about to run. Tonani, she did it so effortlessly. She, she was just very confident, and she, I do think she got easy ingredients or easy things to make. Tonani made um, a soupy noodles with sweet corn and mincemeat. Which was them bad actually. You see what I'm saying about these people's makes? Tolani got a really good mix. And it was eccentric too, not as eccentric as Bookies, but it was very good. And I mean, yeah, I think Tolani beat <laughs> me and myself at Bookie hands down, you know, with her combination. Her food was really nice. And that um, mincemeat was actually really nice. It was actually really nice. And the noodles, I like the texture of the noodles. It was just perfect. And I told her it wasn't soggy. She felt like it was on the cook, but it wasn't. And she thought it was going to get soggy from sitting in the soup for too long, but no, it didn't. It was just perfect. When I, when we're sitting down, I think I gave her a 9 over 10 at that point in time. But looking back, 
and reminiscing on the dish. I think I want to give like nine, nine point five over ten. It was that awesome. Yeah. So I'm going to rate Tolani a nine out of ten. I think she did good. But for me, ah, give myself ten over ten. If I do say so, my own score me high. If not me, I score myself 10 over 10, but for real though, mine was really, 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 really tasty. And I cannot wait for you guys to see the remaining episodes of this show. Till then, bye!